Hi and hello and thank you so much for tuning in and if you are new, welcome to my channel. My name is Preeti Rao and I am both a real estate and a mortgage broker for close to 20 years. Now in today's video, I'm going to talk to you about one of my favorite neighborhoods in Mississauga as it has everything to offer with its village-like setting in the middle of the city and I would love to take you along the ride. So hit that subscription button and that little bell icon so you get notified every time there is a new video uploaded. It gets me motivated to keep you up to date with everything real estate. So the neighborhood we're covering today is called Streetsville, famously known as the village in the city sits on the bank of the Credit River in northern Mississauga, a quaint and charming community with the largest concentration of historic buildings, many of which have been converted into restaurants, spas, cafes and speciality shops. Streetsville was always ideal for the professional families who wanted suburban living with easy access to downtown Toronto and easy access to all the highways, which makes it an ideal place if you are to commute to Toronto and would still love to enjoy the laid-back life. Now, talking about homes in Streetsville. Streetsville boasts very large upscale homes. Real estate turnover is low as families love to stay in their homes for a long period of time. You can find almost every style of home in Streetsville and there are historic homes all over the village. The center of Queen Street, which truly adds to the local charms because of these original homes that have been converted into businesses. A large area has these post-war homes that were built in the 1950s and the 60s around the north and west side of the village. Their homes on big lots have been toned down to make room for custom new-build homes, especially around Streetsville's secondary school. Then in the 70s and the 80s, many more subdivision areas were built for the north and south along the Credit River, offering the more common two-story double-door garage homes. Now if you're looking at lifestyle, aside from Port Credit, no other area of Mississauga City can offer quite suburban living with walking distance to a vibrant downtown the way Streetsville does. The village gets top marks for lifestyle and sense of community. The best part of Streetsville downtown are all the independent restaurants and you wouldn't feel like you're in suburbia. There's Italian, Mexican, Japanese, Thai, there is every flavor to enjoy. Follow it up with a visit to one of the streets with many patio pub bars or perhaps just for ice cream. On any given day, you can grab a coffee, visit the shops, bakeries or the local spa. Take your family bowling or the famous bread and honey festival that takes place every year on the first weekend of June. Join one of their many local clubs or participate in the programs at the local recreational center. Streetsville will keep you active and connected to the community. Now when we talk about the weather, we can mainly talk about the warm weather months. They are the ideal for spending your free time on Queen Street and many residents actually do. Young and old, there is something for everyone and every taste. The Streetsville BIA actively supports local businesses, which enables small shops the opportunity to succeed. This is not a village with big box stores or franchises. This is a quiet community lifestyle that so many of us actually crave. So if you are considering Streetsville as your new home, walking the downtown Queen Street is a must. You will be hard pressed not to like what you see. And if you like to get involved in the community, you will fit right in. Now, although Streetsville is officially part of Mississauga, there is something very special about this village and its history. The residents very much feel that they live in Streetsville more than in Mississauga. Part of the pride is the fact that residents take much care in the village and in its spirit with a strong residents association. They ensure that needs are heard and considered for city issues and planning, because of which there are endless number of clubs and societies and associations for you to join no matter your age. Here are just a few to mention. They have the Royal Canadian Air Cadets, Royal Canadian Army Cadets, Streetsville Library Book Club, Streetsville Kingsman Society, Horticulture Society, Historical Society, the Rotary Club, and many, many more I can go on for another video. 
there is no shortage of events taking place around the Streetsville neighborhood. From a local farmer's market to the dance and fitness events, you can always get out and connect with the community. The village of Streetsville has an excellent website run by the Streetsville BIA and is regularly updated with all the upcoming events, be it summer, winter, doesn't matter. Now let's talk about the schools. Streetsville also offers one of the best schools in Mississauga. Here schools are well regarded and are among the top ranked in Mississauga and the Greater Toronto area. They offer a wide range of public, Catholic and private options for your children. Riverview and Vista Heights have access to two of the best secondary schools in Mississauga. Streetsville World rank in the top 15% and St. Aloysius ranks in the top 3% of all Ontario secondary schools. Vista Heights Elementary School is one of the best elementary schools for ranking. Now much like rest of Mississauga, this area is quickly rising in prices. First time home buyers might now find it very difficult to break into this neighborhood beyond a small townhouse. Premium areas of streets will have broken far past the multi-million dollar mark. The entire area offers good value with the downtown lifestyle, access to Credit River, really good schools and easy go train commuting. But don't be disappointed, even though many areas of streets will are on the higher end of the budget of the average family home buyer, there are small pockets that are still somewhat affordable for the upper middle class families. However, there is a resurgence in the area and a lot of older homes are being bought and torn down and many new custom homes are popping up all over this area. There is a large number of empty nest uh, populations who are starting to move out and allow the new young families to move in. So if you are relocating to Mississauga or even thinking of moving within Mississauga, I'm just a phone call or an email away. Thank you so much for watching and if you find this information useful, please do not forget to subscribe and hit that like button. If you still don't know who I am, just go check out my rating on Google and read my client reviews. Join me next week for more information on different neighborhoods. Till then, you stay safe and thank you so much for watching. And don't forget to call me because I hold the key that opens the door to your dream home.